Please don't forget to wash your hands after playing with toys. This is Eugene Rukai.、Uh, today I'm going to talk about Storm Pegasus. All right.、Um, okay, Storm Pegasus here is the version from 10th anniversary set. It has been released in Malaysia since. Last year of December, but the thing is, I don't see a lot of people using it that time. And now it's quarantine. I don't, you don't get to go to any tournaments. So I want to talk more about this because this is basically one of my favorite Beyblade and is in my current deck right now. And the original combo,、uh, Ten Glaive Quick Dash, is very impressive already because、uh, first off, all Metal Fight、uh, Beyblades. Has quite a not so deep locks here,、uh, which which means they are very easy to get burst. And but for Storm Pegasus compared to others, it's it it is slightly、uh, better and tighter. And this is the version from the Random Booster. So、uh, as you can see, this is sticker. This is not sticker. This is printed and engraved. Okay. So、uh, what I want to say about this is in 2020. How how would they do?、Uh, so I'm going to feature two Beyblades currently released in Malaysia. I'll be using parts that's currently released in Malaysia.、Uh, at the time of this video,、uh, Beyblade Malaysia had announced the new random booster featuring Cosmo Valkyrie and Storm Pegasus, and then、uh, as well as Zoi Longinus, as well as Judgment Joker. So I will be featuring some of those parts in this video, and see how the stock combo can perform. So first opponent will be Dread Longinus, Double O, Expand, Destroy Dash, Send. Judgment Valkyrie, Sting,、uh, Tower, Net. Yeah. 
finish at one point. Three points, Storm Pegasus wins. Overall, I test battle with two of the recent, re recently released uh, Beyblade parts in Malaysia. With the original uh, stock combo, which is Tan Glaive uh, Dash. I, I think it did pretty well. I mean, it couldn't it couldn't win at all with the last spin Beyblade like Drake uh, Longinus because of its size and its roundness, sometimes it's just oval shape and then if it got hit really hard it will become really round. So then of course all of these are round as well and this adds to the stamina. And then uh, surprisingly able to win this one, although, although this is really heavy and have rubber attack layer base with judgment uh, base. So this is a bit surprising to me that our first try, uh, this one managed to spin finish uh, once, but not quite. He still win this one, so I'm going to replace this with another Beyblade. And that Beyblade would be a future release in Malaysia. I think most of Southeast Asia do not have this release yet. but. For future proof reason, I'm going to test this with another combo, see if I can win this one. And the, and the part that I'm going to use is Bleats. Let's go for the battle. Alright, first opponent will be Dread Longinus. Okay. And lastly, Imperial Dragon.
Overall, I really liked Storm Pegasus, even though it's an original thought combo, which is 10 Glaive. It is awesome, as you can see in the battle I made just now. And then, I just swapped this here from uh, 10 Glaive to Bleats, and it matches really well, as because you can try to make your Beyblade rounder this way. Oh, sorry. You can make your big blade rounder this way, cover the place that is not covered by the wing, or make it a one hit KO type of uh, combo. So, and then there's quick here that supports uh, that's origin one of the original parts from uh, Storm Pegasus. Since this one acts like an extreme dash, another version of extreme dash, you could have like a quick dash as well as an extreme dash in your in the same deck, and a non dash version of extreme just to make things more uh, aggressive. And I think that's about it that I need to talk about today. If you like this video, please give me a like and subscribe if you want to see more. And I guess that's it. Thanks for watching, bye bye.